are finding ways to support those impacted by Hurricane Helene. Today, five electric cooperative crews in South Dakota made their way down to South Carolina to help the victims. Dakota Territory's Grant Green caught up with them before they started their trip. The crews were notified yesterday by the South Dakota Rural Electric Association that they will be embarking on this 1200 mile trip. About all we know is we're going to pick in South Carolina to assist a cooperative there. Um, they told us to be ready to be gone for two weeks. Since yesterday, the crews have had to make sure business is in order for the trip and in South Dakota. Transmission Superintendent Wade Bylas says his guys are ready for anything. I mean, we're just going there to try and make the situation better, you know, try and help, lend a, lend a helping hand. And uh, it, it's always nice having that feeling, knowing that you're coming from the outside coming in to help and most of the time people are very grateful. They're expecting to work in all kinds of terrains from swamps to mountainous regions. Sounds like a lot of trees, you know, trees fell down because of the winds of the hurricane, took down the wire. So clearing trees, putting wire back up, fixing wire breaks, uh, maybe fixing a few poles. Hurricane Helene made landfall last Thursday as a Category 4 storm. Earlier today, the Pickens area was visited by Senator Lindsey Graham and Congressman William Timmons. In Sioux Falls, Grant Green, Coda Territory News.